Hi, I'm Dominic. And I'm Kevin. And we're the, the Pines Estate Boys. <laughs> shows her personality. <laughs> Hi, I'm Dominic. And I'm Kevin. And we're the, the Pines Estate, Estate Boys. Boys. Yeah, 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 yeah. So today we are going to be talking about our dining room and the built-in bench that we built. And you know what we got to do a lot of as well? Visit our favorite store in the world. Drum roll, please. Menards! There you go, he speaks. <laughs> yes, Menards. We love Menards because Menards gives you 11% back. So, at the bottom of every one of your receipts, you get a rebate receipt. So you detach that from your receipt. And then, in a couple of months, they send you this, another gift card to spend more money at their store. So, that's why we love Menards. We have like achieved like hundreds of dollars. And it just feeds into the more projects that we can do at our house. So we hope you enjoy our video on building our bench. It was a lot of fun. We've never done it before. Again, like we say, it may not be perfect, but it was done with love. So enjoy our video. Heartbeat. <laughs> Here we are in Menard. My, family, my brother finally met up with us. Getting hinges, nails, screws, uh, vent covers. Now we're trying to find a straight edge. You know, always make a list. Look, it's the only thing straight about Kevin. A straight edge. Straight in the store. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I'm guessing a very long time. Still staring and still searching for wood. And this is where I'm wondering. So I've definitely come to realize that picking out wood is very difficult. And you need people like that to carry it for you. Guys, he's so strong. He's so handsome, so sexy, and so strong. Oh, look at the master at work. Got his work belt. I don't have that stuff. Because I don't really do much. I just more design. I guess that does make me the old lady. But I'm a handsome old lady. Easy way to fix up your vents in your living room, um, I guess in any room. It just happens to be our music room and our dining room. So we just picked up some better designed ones because the ones that we have on the ground right now have rusted from, I guess, just lots of mopping out here. See, there's a prime example of a rusted out vent. Replace those, it helps. They cost about like $17, the ones we bought. And they, uh, yeah, will help make your house look a little bit nicer. Good investment. So now the goal is to measure out the base of our built-in bench using tape. We're gonna go 12 inches away, but our top's gonna be 15, so your feet can naturally rest back on your heels. What would you call this, Joe? Like the back support. The back support. 
safety first. When you're soft, wear your glasses. Now we're figuring out how far we want the bottom to go out. About 12 inches. Well, we now have the shell, the framing, everything is all set and done. And we're we'll start building the top. So we continually add screws to everything. All right, day one of our bench dun, 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 is done, almost done. Just one more, that corner section and uh, the other door and then I've already used wood filler on there and I sand it all off. All right, here we are, day two of doing the bench. Taylor's back, cutting the floorboards. And he asked for a pencil, so I gotta find a pencil. This is a baseboard. Oh, yeah, baseboard. See, I'm not good at these things. <laughs> Now we're cutting the trim for the bench. See, I got that right. It's nice to have one of those saws that you just do this for this. Oh, yeah. Okay. You know what? That's good. So it's not gonna rub? I don't know how it fits in there. Huh? I need to get it back. What is he even looking at? We did it! The bench is done. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah! Dun, 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 dun. Now I gotta sand it, Let's do some wood filler, paint it, stain it. Still a lot more. All right, everybody. So here we are. Uh, day three of the bench work. So today I am going to stain and possibly paint, stain the top and paint the bottom. I'm going to stain the top the same color that I'm going to stain the shiplap that we're eventually gonna put on the walls right there and there, those two walls by the windows. Um, normally people would probably stain their wood uh, before you build the bench, but uh, we didn't do it that way. So I opened all the windows, got my mask, because I'm gonna stain it, and I'm just gonna go let it air out and mow the lawn. And as you can see, I've already taped out everything. And here we go, I stained the top and the inside. Well, I shouldn't say the inside, but the under of the cabinet drawer that we have of our bench right there. Now it's time to put the polyurethane on the bench. 
another day working on the bench. Now it's time to put the green on the bottom of the bench and then touch up all the parts that we've kind of scuffed up in making this bench. Here we go. If you've liked our videos, please like and subscribe. Also visit us on Instagram and TikTok at the Pines Estate Boys. Again, that's at the Pines Estate Boys on Instagram and TikTok. See you later. Bye. Smoke bomb. Poof. We're still here. <laughs>